So the marketplace is certainly very crowded. And differentiation is tough, but I think it gets easier when you get really honest about what unique thing your brand or business has that it actually can own, that the consumers will believe it can own. I'd say, you know, our differentiating factor, and I say this all the time, is really the people that I work with. I mean, you know, you can teach hospitality, and if our managers are gracious, I mean, that's, you can go, there's millions of bars and restaurants all over the world, so we have to figure out why are they going to come to us to drink that basically same product, and really it comes down to the hospitality part of it. the group president at Focus Brands, and I get to work with cool teams to bring yummy food products all over the world to multiple channels, Moe's and Cinnabon and Auntie Anne's and Carvel and Schlotzky's and McAllister's. I introduced myself as the principal and CEO of the Gerber Group, okay. and we own bars and restaurants, primarily in hotels with hotel partners. What's the first question you typically get when you introduce yourself that way? Typically, how did you get into this business? Hmm which was kind of just a fluke. I mean, you know, I was a real estate broker, yeah. and my brother followed me into the business, and we had an opportunity to open a bar. Mm. And we said, that would be fun. Yeah, every guy <laughs> wants to open a bar. Why not? Can I get you guys a drink? Sure. I would love a vodka tonic. <laughs> okay. I would love a uh, margarita with Casamigos Reposado, please. Reposado. Thank you. Awesome. It sounds delicious. Mm, it's good. <laughs> a little more exciting than my drink. <laughs> <laughs> We've been fortunate enough where I have, you know, bar backs and busters that have been with us for 25 years wow. whose kids are now working with us. Oh, that's so cool. And, and I think a lot of that comes from my father. He could have a conversation with the chairman of one of our hotel companies as well as the bar back and buster. And everybody to him was as important as the next person. It didn't matter who you were, what your position was, that's how great. much money you had, but that compassion, I think, really builds like that family environment when you have a company like ours. It reminded me that the people who are closest to the action, you know, the bartenders, the servers, and everyone, um, they know what the right thing to do is yeah. long before the manager does. Yeah, so a managerial good. style that's highly communicative like yours, a managerial style that's highly approachable is going to compress the amount of time between when they know what the right thing to Absolutely. do is and when you do, which is Absolutely. pretty helpful. Hey YouTube fans, I'm Landon Downey from CNBC. Thanks so much for checking out our channel. Here you'll find videos packed with all the info that you need to be smarter about your finances. Be sure and subscribe by clicking right here and click on all the videos around me to see CNBC's original series, Young Money, Tech Bet, Kramer's Mad Money, and all the latest from CNBC.